What's up guys, it's Nick here, and today I've got some new Forza Horizon footage for you, and it looks awesome. This has been circling around the internet, there are a few bits and bobs on here that we have not seen before and we weren't expecting to be in the game, uh, and there's also the map. Now, to start off with, I'm going to pause it straight away because, as you can see, the auction house is back. Now, if you're new to Forza and you haven't played, uh, I think it was the last time it was in, it was Forza Motorsport 4. Uh, this is where you could buy and sell your own cars, uh, and buy other people's cars, designs, everything. It was sort of a sharing commu uh, community. I actually used it a lot. Uh, I was annoyed when they took it away because it was, I mean, a sense of community and also you could get some uni unicorn cars which were really rare um, but also, you could also get, uh, when you bought the car it would have all their setup on it so if you bought someone's car and it was a drift car it would already have all the dri their drift settings up usually it would be really good um, and it, you could actually sometimes get cars cheaper than uh, on, the mar uh, on the normal marketplace so that was awesome and then this is the player card now this is on the storefront and it, you can actually follow creators and it, whenever they make a new design or a new tune setup it will show you straight away and that's good in the way because there's some designers that are amazing and if you like a particular design you can just follow them now this is a quick time lapse I've just put in because it's quite cool uh, it shows the detail and the, the quality of the game now the next bit is the best bit the map now they show it quite fast, here you go, so from Byron Bay, the 12 popular, I can't even say that, uh, then you've got Surface Paradise and it goes left towards the outback, and it just shows how big the map is, it's absolutely massive, and Yara Valley is stuff like that, and the reservoir, and I'll slow it down to show you the amount of events is unbelievable, then we've got speed traps confirmed, um, and look, so on the right where the 12 Apocalypse is, is the Great Ocean Road, and then we go up to probably the biggest city in Forza Horizon history. I mean, it's huge surface paradise in this game. Go to the left, you'll see there is an airport going through that long highway along into the outback. And then we go down again through the valley. Now, it doesn't actually show the whole map. It just shows that little section. It just shows how big it is. And I'm not even sure that it's the whole map. Um, so, we don't know. And they said that the map is twice the size in Forza Horizon 2. Now, I don't think it will be, but it'll be impressive. And now, straight away on the screen, as you can see, is Ford versus Holden. And if you don't know what Holden is, it's basically Australia's car manufacturing. The only one they make out there that's their own. Um, and there's a big, famous fight between Ford and Holden in the V8 Supercar Championship. And you look at all the different events there. And you've got another lovely shot of the new Lamborghini. But that will be it, guys, for this little section. Um, there's a lot of Forza news coming out, so I'm trying to cover it all. Uh, there'll be a new screenshots video coming out later, uh, and then they've got details about the pre-ordering, uh, and then the free cards you can get if you are a Forza veteran. But that should be up this week. And thanks for watching, guys. If you're new, subscribe for Forza Horizon News, and I'll see you guys later.